I'm attempting to juggle the war with Greece as well as continue to build our empire up, get out districts and things like that because we're we're going to fall behind in culture and science if I'm focused too heavily on this war with Gorgo. But luckily the war with Gorgo is, is going pretty well. I mean, I've, I've almost destroyed her walls here and we're going to do a lot more damage in the next one. Uh, oh, it looks like, did America make peace with Scythia? Yes, yes, yes he did. Yes, he and she did. Uh, that's scary. Because, as I said, as I've been saying this entire time, I'm most concerned that Scythia is now going to attack us. I don't know where she at, she is in terms of military strength. Let's go ahead and find out. So Germany's number one with just under a thousand. Then Norway. Oh, this is great news. Okay, that's really, really good news. So Scythia has somehow fallen to uh, sixth place. So she must have lo lost. I'm sorry, fourth, fifth place. I'm sorry. Uh, she must have lost a lot of units. Yeah, fifth, fifth place. Did I say that right? She's one, two, three, four. I don't know. I'm smoking crack already. Uh, America here, right behind her. Congo. Oh yeah, Gorgo. We got her way down there, way down here. I don't feel too comforting, too comfortable though, that I'm only at 250, and uh, everybody else is way ahead of me. But obviously, we pretty much wrecked Greece's AI so far. Uh, and again, it was just good placement of the encampment. I think that that can stop a lot of, a lot of really good attacks. So I'm thinking we need to build an encampment in this city too. A really well placed encampment could pretty much halt, I think right here on this uh, hill forest, that would be really tough to combat against. Just boom, boom, boom. Yeah, that would be too distracting. And especially if we get artillery weapons at some point, being able to attack three tiles away would be huge. Huge. Okay, so let's uh, let's improve this wheat. You have not grown your borders all that much, have you? No. You're not even growing in terms of population and stuff like that. So that kind of sucks. What are you working? Why are you, what are you doing? I don't know what you're doing. Here, you lock this down, lock this down. And then eventually we'll grow towards the, the, the gems. I'll be able to sell that amenity off to somebody, I, I think. You're at 10 population, but I don't think I can improve any tiles here. I don't think you're working anything. Oh, yeah, you are. I guess that's the best tile you can work. Okay, well, let's get on that as quickly as possible. Let's also be careful because there's... Uh, Drew, there is a catapult right nearby. So be careful of that. So he has a heavy chariot, or she has a heavy chariot. I don't know where she ran towards with that heavy chariot. She ran towards someplace. I don't want to keep taking damage to this unit, so I'm going to attack the catapult, see if I can't get him to, to back up. And we'll do kind of a shot there. Uh, you're distracting, with, distracting me with all these units. I don't like that. Hmm, okay, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try to slowly take this guy down. Should I... I can't really do anything about that catapult over there. Let's shoot at you. I don't think I'm ready to put the spearman and the battering ram in place just yet. And and really, that only is going to help melee attacks. So until my until my heavy chariot is in play, it's not going to help us all that much. Can you... Can you give me gold per turn from this? No. Okay. What about this amenity for amenity? Ooh, I actually might take that, because I, I still have extra gems, and I'm going to get another source of gems very soon here, too. This should help us all around the Empire. Let's do it. Because I know that we're suffering from more wariness here, and so we need to somehow continue to fuel uh, this war effort. Because I want to take down roads, and I want to take down this city. I don't like that this city was settled. That was a big a big Mantis. issue with that. I don't, I don't like that at all. Okay, so please kill this guy. Thank you. Um, we need to kill a lot of these units, which I don't see how we can do that. One, two, have you attacked yet? You have not attacked yet. Okay, so perfect. I'm going to move you in play, because I think it's time to move in now. I'm going to scoot you out. Dang. Shouldn't have scooted you out. There's nothing I could do. I, I didn't realize that there's nothing I could do with that. Well, we need to take you down for sure, because the warrior cannot be there. He, he just he needs to go. Can I do anything with this guy? No, and he needs to be right next to his target, so that's that's a big problem there. Yeah, so I'll scoot him up. We're going to go straight in for Rhodes. Can I get this kill? I'm going to get this kill instead, because I'm not worried about the catapult. I'm not as worried about the catapult as I am a, a heavy chariot that maybe gets a promotion and upgrades to full strength and stuff like that. Okay, uh, City State, I appreciate that you destroyed this encampment, but you didn't kill the Spearman. So, uh, what is up with that? I don't know. I don't even know. 
So pipe in time, I guess so. Earn great scientists, build an aqueduct, have a government, I'll eventually get to upgrade or boost castles. I'm thinking. What are we working again? We're working that tile. So let's come here. Okay, so you finished your my crouching tiger. Thank you. Thank you very much. I'm gonna hold off on the districts. I'm gonna build a few more things. I think we'll maybe go with uh I don't know. Is there something else I can build for a little bit quicker? I'm going to build one extra Spearman. Do we need it? I could use it for the Scythian border anyways. Yeah, so I, I'll, I'll do it just strictly for the border with Tomyris. If, if, I mean, because I don't know if I'm going to be able to bring that melee unit in play. There's only so many tiles I can use here. But uh, if anything, I could send him to the west. Yeah, so that, that'll be no problem. Beijing is going to be a great city. I'm glad it has extra housing too. We also have a settler coming out of this city. So when I burn this guy down roads, we can just take up that position. Man, I need another envoy. I need another envoy to get this militaristic city state on my side. That was helpful. You better watch your trader, man. You're not trading with Greece, are you? You better not be, man. Don't do it. Okay, let's get this kill. Thank you. You're not growing. This city's not growing at all. This city will be... Here, you, you're gonna chill. You're gonna chill. I don't need to waste builders. Okay, Drew, don't waste builders. That's stupid. So I'll come... I'll come here. Oh, okay, good. Yeah, okay, so you did take down the uh, Barbarian Spearmen. Okay, I'm glad that you did that. Okay, so it's time to attack the city. We've taken care of all the units that we needed to. You go back up on the encampment. Um, you need to get... Oh, man, you're not doing too well. I'm still going to put you there. I might need to back somebody out of this soon. I probably will. And yeah, you know what? I think, let's see, do you need extra housing? You do need extra housing, so we might as well build a barracks. Yeah, so that's only going to take three turns, three turns anyways. If anyone is going to be moved out of the way, I'll, I'll just move you here. All these rivers make it difficult, man. All these dang rivers. Okay, so everyone else is already... I, I might as well go for it. Boom, let's do it. So we pretty much killed the walls. There will be no regeneration of, of health, right? That also means he won't be generating his health back, I don't think. Gotta watch this warrior. Please just give me a promotion. That would be great if you just gave me a promotion out of that. Okay, so yeah, I don't think I need to improve the city anymore. What I'm gonna do instead is uh, move him to there and we'll get some infrastructure laid down and things like that so that's what we'll do yes you did get a promotion so I'll just promote you I guess combat strength when defending against range attacks yeah this is a perfect scenario to do that in and you can build a mine two extra production I like it you ca uh, here let's let's give you a promotion range strength versus land yes that's super useful in this scenario here Okay, so how many range hits can we get? Can we take the city now? That would be great. I don't know if we will. Also, don't we want this guy to be in the middle? Yes, all adjacent land units, I think. So let's move the battering ram with the crouching tiger. That way both melee units can get the the boost. Okay, yeah, negative 57 health. I, I think we can take it. it uh, it's still going to be close. Yeah, I think we got it. So there's... Oh, no, I don't know. Oh, I don't want to lose anything. There we go. We got it. Okay. So, as I said, we have got to burn this stuff down because Scythia wouldn't give it to us anyways. Uh, there is a bug that... There's a bug... I'm sorry, not Scythia. Gorga wouldn't give it to us anyways. There's a bug that allows us to take... Gor Gorgo's not supposed to give up anything. It's confusing. There's a bug. Just, just know that there's a bug. And, uh... I, I could technically keep this city, but something would happen to my war wariness, even though the war is over. I don't really know. I've got to raise it down. Goodbye. Boom. Just, that's all that matters. <laughs> so I've got my settler coming. We can settle that position, or we could settle up here, too. One of these spots, I'm going to settle in, and I want to burn this guy down, too. So that'll be the plan. And then I'll bring you over for some reinforcements. Somebody needs to start heading off towards the north. A few people, actually, need to head towards the north. 
And you probably just need to run back home, to be honest, because these barbarian encampments are going to kill you. Okay, so let's be careful of the final remaining catapults. Um, wait a second. Did I not get... I don't... I think I was supposed to build... I, was, I thought I was going to build another spearman. Well, the spearmen will, will eventually send them over towards Tamiris. Eventually, somebody will go over there. So, yeah, let's get food and hammers back so you grow a little bit quicker. And we lay down more infrastructure. I like it. We need that as China. I talked about how important that is. Very, very important. Let's lock you down. Oh, that's a great tile now. Four production. That is good. And then I'm just going to hide you inside the city until you need to do something else. Okay, so how much damage can we do? We do not do... Oh, that's bad. Yes, we need to get out of here. Let's go back this way. Maybe we can try to get him to come towards us. We'll see. Okay, so who has the most promotions? I want to send the two crossbowmen that have these fields thingies. Okay, so I'm going to put you here so I can take down the catapult eventually. He'll stay there for defense. And uh, you guys are coming with me. Uh, let's promote this guy. Combat strength versus fortified defender. Combat strength when defending against range attacks. Let's do charge. I've got another builder. What am I going to do with all these damn builders? It's It's got to be cutting into unit maintenance. It's got to. Uh, I'm going to back you up so that you can heal. Let's do let's do the same thing with you. And I got to take this. Oops. Whoops. I did not mean to do that. Man, unit cycling. Never a good thing. It's not, it always causes for that, those scenarios to take place. I feel like this builder has been taken forever, man. I feel like this builder has been taken forever. No, okay. Let's take that. Let us take that. Maybe it was a good thing because now I, I wouldn't have had vision on the settler. Let's take that and lay down my six city too, if I can. Okay, so we have a different game plan now. We want to kill this guy. And I'm going to come here for the vision. Okay, good. So let's see what he does with him. Let's, let's hope the AI does a stupid move, which they do. They tend to do that. Um, okay, we got extra housing. You're not growing anyways. Oh, you are still growing. You just have negative amenities. Let's give you the amphitheater. More culture per turn. I like that. Um, I'm going to come after you so we can kill you. Oh, my gosh. I hate this so much. Unit cycling. That what is going on? Okay, well, whatever. Whoa, be careful there. I did not mean to back this guy up, but whatever. Uh oh, our our we're gonna take some damage here if this hoplite attacks us. Hoplite. I'm gonna attack you with my scout. Hey, we actually do a little bit of damage, but I'm not gonna do that. Let's get some vision. I don't think there's much over here in terms of defense that they have. Granary's gonna finish. Commercial hub still has a while. But I think gold is going to be our biggest ally in this campaign. Thank you for the delegations. Yes. Okay. Thank you. Now, one reason to continue to build up a military is so that other people don't declare war on us. I know that we're doing fine now, but we do need to keep in mind that the AI considers, you know, what you got going on in your own military. So, just got to keep some of this stuff in mind. Okay, take him down, please. So tired of fighting this guy. Thank you. Okay, so he's dead. Hmm. I'm going to take a risk. Maybe I should not, because the AI more than likely will do something stupid. Where'd the hoplite run to? I don't know. I don't know where he ran to, but whatever. And then you guys need to create an escort. The, the heavy chariot... Okay, there he is. So let's be careful of him. Let's wait for the heavy chariot to get there in place. Oh, he's going to get wrecked, though, by the hoplite so we gotta be careful of that um don't i have the monarchy don't I have monarchy okay i'm having kind of monarchy come in one turn so let's go ahead and go castles here just in case let's they shouldn't be able unless they have a range unit i'm just gonna take a risk if i lose the scout then whatever there's nothing in there so perfect so we need to move in there fast you're going to sleep. I've got so many builders. Like, this is ridiculous. Too many builders here. It's crazy. Okay. Yeah, you should probably work on a district as well. 
Uh, or, or you know what, a boat. Okay, I'm gonna work on at least one range boat, because I talked about how important that would be to fight Scythia along the coast in this choke point anyways. So that is pretty good. Um, I do want an encampment. And you're gonna keep growing. Yeah, this is too good. Oh, I can't do it yet. Is there something quick that you can build? Like a few turns, a scout. No, that's not that's not quick enough. No projects, nothing. Hmm. I guess we'll go with the monument for now, and then I might stop them and do it do something else with it. We're not making very much gold per turn, so it's gonna take us a while to get there. Two turns at least, till I can buy this tile. Conclude, then, this point. Yeah, so that, that kind of sucks. That's not good. Okay, so we've got our monarchy. What do I want next? Cassus Bell Eyes, maybe? I guess? Guilds, commercial hub, adjacency bonuses, I guess that's a good thing too. Oh, here we go. Let's go medieval fairs. Fairs? Medieval fairs. And it's time for the monarchy. Okay, perfect. So the monarchy is going to be great. It's going to add extra, extra housing, as well as I want plus two influence points. Influence points. So that will keep us, that'll keep us safe against, or hopefully it, uh, allow us to get more city-state friends. So I'm going to go with that. And then maybe amenities for garrison units, because I might have a lot of garrison units just kind of sitting around. So I'm going to do that there. And then 100% production towards defensive buildings. Uh, that's not a terrible idea, but. Um, but I'm going to choose over the break. I'm going to have to stop right there, and then I'll come back and we'll continue our war against Greece. I'm really hoping Greece messes up and allows me to take that settler out there in the east, because uh, if I don't have to build a settler, that would be ideal. Because I want, like I said, like seven, eight, nine cities. At, at the end of the campaign, I at least want ten, uh, hopefully as China, whether we take it or settle it, uh, settle land. It depends. But anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.